I'm staring directly into the sun. It's golden hour. This is what I like to do most evenings. Just come up here, watch the sunset. Lighting's pretty good as well. Music's gonna get the video demonetized, whatever. I got a channel update. Effective immediately. You can expect new videos Monday, Wednesday, Friday. It's taken me 18 months to realize that this channel has lost its sense of identity. And I've let all of you down. This channel's lost its edge, it's lost its mojo, and it's lost its unapologetically weird creator, myself. <laughs> I think I've been making videos based on what I think other people would expect me to be making or maybe making videos trying to optimize for monetization or views, subscribers, or trying to niche myself in a certain topic rather than just talking about what I want to talk about. Like a video like this, feeling like I'm just talking directly to you and the camera and on the go, setting up in the wild, doing it. About 18 months ago, this channel caused me to face issues in my previous software sales job. And that was my fault. It was a traumatic experience. And I think it caused me to sort of put up the mask and say, well, if I actually show up as my full self, if I actually share my truth, if I actually share what I'm thinking or express too much passion, I could face repercussions. I could be negative. And logically, I was like, all right, well, let me just avoid that. Let, let, let me just not, not do that situation. So I deleted all my LinkedIn posts. I took down 900 videos from this channel. And I, I think I've been playing scared recently. And it's, it's no way to live. It's no way to be. I, there's no way for me to do my best work if I'm not showing up as myself. Whether it's making YouTube videos, whether it's sales conversations, whether it's making cold calls, whether it's connecting with friends and family, I gotta show up as myself. And if that's not received positively, then so be it. And I have to live with that. So I've, I've realized that I've been letting everyone down, including myself. And all I can do is learn from it. No one's gonna come save me. No one's gonna come do things for me. I have no excuses to make. All I can do is grow and put together a new plan of action to change things. So what I've done is I've identified what the problem is. I've been scared to be myself, <laughs> which is crazy. So it's not like you just flip a switch and you're like, okay, now I'm authentic, whatever. I think it's a process, but I ordered a new camera so that I can start making videos out and about. I'm always moving around and I think my best content is when I'm just in the moment. I have an idea. There's no scripts, as you guys know. There's no editing. I just put it down and, and just start going and talking about what's top of mind and my truth. So that's what you can expect going forward. The video is going to get better. And I'm excited for what's ahead. So thanks so much for being here. I posted over a thousand videos in this four year process, this journey. I feel like it's day one again. And. I feel that I feel that energy again. I feel like I have something to prove. So we're back. I'm more, I'm waking up 5 a.m. running every day, six miles, making a lot of calls, getting a lot of sleep, optimizing my water, my diet, and we're focused right now. I'm trying my best. I want more. I want to be successful, and I'm not satisfied. And I I, I think there's some of you out there who probably resonate with that. You want more too. I'm sort of sick and tired of consuming too much content as well. So I don't know if anyone relates to that. So I need to start making more content rather than just consuming content. I'd encourage some of you to think about that as well if you wanna make some content. But anyways, I'm fully focused on my software sales job. My goals are to hit my quota every quarter. My goals are to promote to a senior account executive and all that matters are results. Doesn't matter what I say on this video. Doesn't matter how much I want to promote or hit my goals, all that matters is how much revenue I generate. Can I get pipeline? Can I close the deals? Can I add value to the customers? And can I continuously repeat that process until it's predictable and formulaic and I'm hitting, I'm hitting big revenue numbers every month, every quarter. I believe in myself. I know I have what it takes to be successful and I wanna maximize my potential. And that's what I'm thinking about. That's what's on my mind. 
and I appreciate those of you who are willing to give me another chance. Let's go.